guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here today's vlog is super exciting because i am going to get my tape and hair extensions if you um follow my blog you would know that i have um clip-ins right now obviously there's nothing in here um but it was getting to the point where i have two sets of clip-ins they are the 20 inch and the 24 inch so i use the 24 inch for braids and the 20 inch for everyday stuff and it was getting to the point where they were just getting ratty i'd had them um one of them since last october and the other one i got in december so i'd had them for quite a while and with how much i use them they lasted forever and i love 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 them and i would consider buying them again the same brands and everything i use um lexi hair and bella me and they're both great i actually have a coupon code for luxy hair it's all caps born five for five dollars off but i really wanted to try something different and so my sweet hair stylist who you'll see in this vlog she's seriously like adorable i was i've been talking to her about tape ins and she can do them so i decided to go for it and the cost of the hair was about the same i obviously have to pay for putting them in and then every six to eight weeks you get them moved up but if you don't know what tape in extensions are they're basically one step above the clip-ins they kind of look like the clip-ins because they're like little strips but um they are like more permanent if that makes sense like you don't take them out every night so yeah i'm really excited it's funny because i was cleaning my room last night and i found my hair extension set from like my sophomore year of high school and then i also have had clip-ins like in middle school so i've been obsessed with hair extensions for a long time so i'm excited to actually try some new stuff so yeah i'm going to head to the salon really quick i guess uh before i head there i'll show you guys the clip of my before hair and then at the end you'll see the after here this is courtney isn't Hi. she cute <laughs> we're about to put my hair extensions in i'm so excited about them she matched them so well you're <laughs> so cute okay courtney's gonna explain everything so first before i put her extensions in i'm gonna use a detoxifying shampoo to really clean her scalp because for the next two months it's gonna have tape ends right at her scalp <laughs> and uh, we're just gonna use really heavy masks to moisturize her ends she comes in pretty often so her <laughs> ends are healthy and then we'll blow dry and put her extensions in i'm so excited you guys are awesome i was i like woke up like it was christmas i was like today's the day <laughs> i know i was thinking i was like oh, she's so excited <laughs> Never seen these before. Yeah, and they just feel like they don't feel like clip-ins. Like they're like, you can feel it right They just feel like flat. Yeah. Like you can't even tell like that they're there. No, you really can't. Uh, like you can feel mom's a lot more than this even. Yeah, you can. Wow. I'm obsessed. <laughs> now we're going to style my hair. <laughs> she did such a good job blending it. If you live in Kansas City <laughs> or yeah. Overland Park or wherever, come to Courtney. I am going to be at uh, Park Salon's College in Kibera location across from Juco. I'll leave all of her info below too. Because she's the best. <laughs> Thank you. So I clamp it, spin it around once, and then I pull. And that is how I do it. <laughs> I'm gonna film it a few more times too. That's totally. I actually might put this in. <laughs> That's okay. This is how she's gonna curl my hair. She did this last time, and I'm so bad at doing it with straighteners. So I like to, whenever I curl, 
I like to pull the straightener down when I curl so it creates a longer curl. So I'm like pulling it down and curling it instead of pulling it straight, like straight out, out and making it super bouncy. Ooh, I didn't even know that's like how they made them bouncy. See how, yeah, the ends are like a little bouncier. So oh, gotcha. I'll just straighten it a little bit. Curling them all in the same direction? No. I curl the front just like right in front of the ear in the same direction. After that, I do a few. Sorry, I like cut off your face because it's like an awkward angle. <laughs> um, so in front of the in front of the ear, I curl them all back away from the face, and then all the way to the back of the head, I split it in half. I curl mainly all of them away from the face, but some I will curl in the opposite direction. That way it adds fullness and it kind of breaks it up so they don't all bear with the other. And she keeps them like this so she can pull them apart at the end. Yeah, I like them to cool in that position so um, they can just kind of like set while the heat cools it'll just set in that curl so they won't fall apart. And if you come see Courtney, don't pull them apart because she'll get mad at you. <laughs> it's my favorite part of the appointment is pulling the curls apart. I get so <laughs> salty when people do that. <laughs> Oh, it looks so good. I keep cut. I'm sorry. Like you're like really high up there, so I feel like I'm only pulling myself. <laughs> Very tossable. It looks so good. Another thing with extensions is um, yeah, you probably were used to those paint things, but when you brush them, you don't want to start up here. Just like with normal hair, you want to start at the bottom, the end, especially with tape ends, because you don't want to be ripping out of hair. That makes sense. So just always start from the bottom. And also, if you want a wet brush, wet brushes are really, really good. That's what I use. Cool. Oh, I love it. It's weird that it just like feels like my hair too. Like it doesn't feel like my clip-ins. <laughs> so soft. It's like softer than our hair. <laughs> I know. That's what I need to start doing. <laughs> Whenever my hair gets really dull, add in extensions. Just put in some extensions and it'll make it softer. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, guys, I am so in love with it. It looks so good. She did an amazing job blending it, and I have the utmost faith in her. She always does so amazing. She's the one that colors my hair and everything, but after seeing some videos on YouTube, I was like, oh, some of these girls, like, their hair looks really thin at the end, but like, Seriously, I mean, it looks like my hair. Sorry, like, not to toot my own horn and be like, it looks so good, but I'm so excited about it. So, thank you so much, Courtney, if you watch this. I love it, lo love it. She's seriously the best. Like I said, I need to catch my breath because I'm so excited, so hold on. Like I said, I'm going to link all of her information below, like what salon she's at, her Instagram and all that. Please follow her because she's adorable and the best. And go to her if you are in the Kansas City area or if you, like, ever come visit the Kansas City area, like, make a trip. Like, she's one of those people that, like, she's so amazing. So, yeah. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I am so excited about my new hair, and I hope you guys found this video helpful or entertaining or whatever. And if you did, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Also, if you want to see, like, a update from my hair, like, how I like it, how it's holding up in, like, the next six or eight weeks or, like, whenever, leave a comment down below. So yeah, thanks again, Courtney, and thank you to everybody for watching, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye. Bye.